Phil Brown Ale, uh, which is interesting uh, with its touch of, uh, of a peat smoke mold, so you, you really find it in the beer. And, and I don't know why, but I immediately thought of orange. I associated it with orange. Um, usually, wh when I work with whiskies, um, peated molds go very well with citrus fruit. And, and so I wanted a, a, a touch of orange here. Um, and uh, so I thought venison would be nice, but um, I have my principles. I never cook venison. I like the bumbies, so I don't cook venison. <laughs> And uh, I could do a duck, breast of duck with uh, a marmalade sauce. Duck, very difficult to get on Isla. So uh, I, want to I wanted to keep it Isla as well. So it will be Isla beef, a steak, a big meaty steak, uh, which I'm going to, um, to spice a lot with pepper. And I will grate dark chocolate, 100% cocoa on it. Uh, that's the Mexican touch of it on it, but it, it makes it makes it a very rich sauce, and uh, and that beer can stand something rich. So I've chosen a steak, sirloin steak for Phil Brown, a steak, sizzle, pepper, salt, grated chocolate. Not any dark chocolate, a very, very dark chocolate, 99% cocoa. So it's more used as a spice than really chocolate. So it may sound a bit weird, but uh, it's not so much. Deglaze with uh, cream. And poured on the steak. Done. Mmm, good. So Dan, since we're going into a nice sirloin first, I feel that you got to do the honors. This I was very beautifully prepared. And we're I hope I have cooked it well. Maybe it's not enough medium rare for you. Oh, it's perfect. Oh, that's but, perfect. Um, uh, if it's overcooked, then it, it gets very hot. So. Now, we're of course pairing that with Phil Brown. This is the real Phil Brown. <laughs> but I'm not can, you t can you taste the chocolate? This sort of bitterness yes, of the chocolate? Mm. It's all, uh, um, Chocolate, and then the, the fill. That really works well. Spicy. Mm. Peppery. I think I need, I think I need some more. Mm -hmm. That does work really well. It doesn't take the bitterness away because the chocolate has the bitterness in it. So it lets that come through, plus a little bit of the peat. We really do have peat in this one. Mm. Because it's quite a strong beer, I mean, in taste. Yeah. I Absolutely. Don't know, in, uh, in, in alcohol, in, too. And alcohol also. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So that's that's for people who like spicy oh, because it's peppery. It's very peppery. You can you can put less pepper, but I like it quite uh, you know straight in the face. Cool. The chocolate's so subtle and it works so nicely with the, with the malt and with the peat and. Mm -hmm.